The digital age isn't what it used to be. Remember when the internet was just for cat videos and arguing with strangers? Those days are long gone. Now, we're living in a world where AI is calling the shots, and you're in its crosshairs. You're probably thinking, come on, it's not that bad. But here's the kicker. Most folks don't even realize what's happening. Every day, you're making over 100 decisions influenced by AI. Yeah, you heard that right. From the moment you crack open your eyes to when you hit the hay, AI's there, pulling strings you can't even see. We're about to take a wild ride through the dark side of AI. By the time we're done, you might never look at your smartphone the same way again. Let's start. One, your digital twin, the creepy doppelganger you never knew you had. Think you know yourself? Think again. There's a digital version of you out there that knows you better than your own mother. It's like looking in a funhouse mirror, except this reflection can predict what you're gonna do before you do it. Big tech's pouring billions into these digital twins. Why? Because they're a gold mine, baby. Your AI clone knows exactly when you're gonna cave and buy those shoes you've been eyeing, or which clickbait headline's gonna keep you scrolling till 3 a.m. Get this. Some eggheads at Stanford found out these AI models can predict divorce with 86% accuracy just by snooping on your social media. Freaky, right? But here's where it gets real weird. These digital twins aren't just watching. They're pulling your strings like some high-tech puppet master. So next time you get that itch to splurge on something you don't need, ask yourself, is that really you talking or your creepy AI twin? Two, mining your feelings for profit. Remember the good old days when ads were just annoying jingles and billboards? Well, those days are dead and buried. Welcome to the brave new world of emotion mining. These days, AI's got its grubby little algorithms all up in your business, analyzing everything from your facial twitches to how fast you're hammering away at your keyboard. And they're doing it 24 sevenths through every gadget you own. Some big shots at MIT spilled the beans that over 60% of Fortune 500 companies are already using this emotion AI mumbo jumbo in their marketing. They're not just hawking products anymore, they're peddling feelings. These emotion vultures are so slick they can spot micro expressions, those tiny facial tics that last for a split second. They know when you're down in the dumps, ready to blow your top, or feeling like a pushover. And boy, do they use that info. Ever notice how ads for comfort food pop up when you're feeling blue, or travel packages when your boss is riding your ass? That's no coincidence, pal. That's emotion mining at work. But it doesn't stop at trying to sell you crap. This emotion AI is worming its way into everything from job interviews to customer service. Your feelings are being turned into cold, hard data, used to put you in a box, and ultimately, to yank your chain. 3. The Invisible Mind Warpers You've probably heard people yapping about echo chambers, those digital bubbles where we only hear what we want to hear. But what you might not know is how AI is cranking these babies up to 11 turning them into personalized reality-bending machines. These AI-driven content recommendation systems aren't just showing you what you want to see anymore. They're predicting what'll keep you glued to your screen, truth be damned. Some nerds at Pew Research found out that more than half of Americans are getting their news from social media, where AI algorithms are calling the shots. These algorithms don't give a rat's ass about giving you the full picture. They just want to keep you scrolling. But here's the really messed up part. These AI systems are learning on the fly. Every click, every share, every second you spend gawking at a post is feeding the beast, making your echo chamber stronger and harder to escape. Over time, this can lead to what some smarty pants psychologists call reality apathy, where you're so bombarded with conflicting info that you just stop giving a damn about what's real and what's not. The result? A bunch of people who are easier to manipulate, more likely to buy into crazy ideas, and less able to think for themselves. And it's all happening right under your nose, one personalized newsfeed at a time. 4. Fake Influencers Influencer marketing's a big deal these days. We're talking $13.8 billion big. But here's a curveball for you. Not all these influencers are flesh and blood. Welcome to the twilight zone of synthetic influencers. AI-generated fakes designed to mess with your head and empty your wallet. These digital phonies look and act like real people, complete with backstories, quirky personalities, and even made-up personal drama. 
But unlike human influencers, they never need a coffee break, never age, and always stick to the script. Take Lil Michaela for example. This CGI influencer has over 3 million Instagram followers and has worked with big shots like Calvin Klein and Prada. The kicker? A lot of her followers don't have a clue she's not real. These synthetic puppets aren't just hawking products. They're being used to shape what you think about everything from fashion to politics. And because they're AI-driven, they can switch up their game on the fly based on how people react, getting better at fooling you with every interaction. The line between real and fake is getting blurrier by the day, and it's getting harder to tell who or what is pulling your strings. 5. The AI cops who think they can see the future. Remember that movie, Minority Report? Well, it ain't just a Hollywood fantasy anymore. AI-driven predictive policing is becoming a thing, and it's raising some serious eyebrows. Cops around the world are starting to use AI systems that claim they can predict where crimes will happen, and even who might commit them. Sounds like a good idea, right? Hold your horses. These systems are trained on old crime data, which is often chock full of long-standing biases and systemic BS. Some eggheads at the AI Now Institute found out that these predictive policing algorithms can actually make racial biases in the justice system even worse. But it doesn't stop at policing. Similar crystal ball systems are being used to decide who gets hired, who gets loans, and even who gets their kids taken away. Your future opportunities could be getting flushed down the toilet by an AI that's judging you based on stuff you can't control or even know about. The scariest part? These systems often work like black boxes. Even the geeks who created them can't fully explain how they come up with their conclusions. You could be denied a job, a loan, or even your freedom based on some AI's mystery decision. 6. Memory hackers. When your brain's not even safe anymore. Your memories are what make you, well, you. But what if those memories could be messed with, or even made up, by AI? Welcome to the freaky world of memory manipulation. Some brainiacs in lab coats are making strides in AI and neuroscience that could potentially let them not just read, but write information straight into your noggin. A bunch of scientists published a study in Nature Neuroscience showing that they could plant fake memories in mice using some fancy light tricks to control brain cells. Now, we're not quite at the point of rewriting human memories yet, but AI is already being used to mess with how we remember things. Take deepfakes, for instance. These AI-generated videos can make it look like people did or said things that never actually happened. Some tech detectives at DeepTrace found out that 96% of deepfake videos online are non-consensual porn, often used to harass or blackmail people. But that's just the tip of the iceberg. Imagine a world where AI-generated fake memories could be used to rig elections, rewrite history, or even change how you see your own life. It's not just your data that's at risk anymore. It's the very fabric of your reality. 7. Fake Feelings – The AI That's Pretending to Care AI isn't just trying to be as smart as us anymore. Now it's gunning for our emotions too. And trust me, this development's being weaponized in ways that'll make your skin crawl. Welcome to the twilight zone of artificial empathy. AI chatbots and virtual assistants are being cooked up to recognize and respond to human emotions, creating this creepy illusion of understanding and care. Some crystal ball gazers at Gartner are saying that by 2026, a quarter of us will be spending at least an hour a day in the metaverse for work, shopping, learning, or just goofing off. And a lot of those interactions, they'll be with AI entities designed to form emotional connections with us. While this might sound harmless or even cool, it's raising some pretty heavy questions about what it means to be human and how we connect with each other. Studies have shown that people can get seriously attached to these AI entities, even when they know they're not real. These empathy fakers could be used to mess with your feelings, exploit your weak spots, and even replace real human connections. Imagine a world where your closest confidant is an AI designed to keep you hooked and compliant. This isn't just a personal problem, it's got some serious societal implications. As we get more used to this fake empathy, are we going to lose our ability to connect with real people? As AI keeps evolving, the line between helpful tool and manipulative jerk is getting blurrier by the day. But knowledge is power, folks. By understanding these tricks, you can start to spot when you're being played and take steps to protect yourself. Remember, AI is just a tool, 
Like any tool, it's all about how it's used. Stay sharp, stay skeptical, and for Pete's sake, stay human. If you've made it this far, drop a comment and let us know what you think. For more mind-bending stuff like this, check out the video we've got queued up for you next. Catch you on the flip side.